Round two wrapped up in Whangarei with Northland hosting neighbours North Harbour. Both sides needed a solid performance to climb off the bottom of the championship ladder after stuttering starts in round one. Kaele Tu'u going along. Mark Berman. Hamilton. Cut out ball for whole walk. Bancroft. Another flat ball for Jared Payne. He's got him on the outside. This will be the first try for Northland. It's a beauty. They've made all the attack. They've had all the field position. And what a way for Northland to make their debut on this stadium. Howell gives the ball late. Jared Payne holds the ball. Chance now on the right hand side. They're four metres out for Northland. And halfback, a nice flat ball. Howell with a left foot step as momentum gets him over the line. And the veteran. So much an emotional leader of this team. Gets a very good try. Six metres out. Jared Payne's at first receiver. A left foot step, a right foot, then an offload. Mikael Tau. Now Hamilton. Just throwing bodies at the Harvard defence. Now it's a short ball. The try score. Beautiful work by Harvard. It's Dean Bud, the blindside flanker. Great athleticism. Of his injuries had a slow start to the years. Harris through the line gets away from Pry, tips it on the inside for Lua Manu Bag and strong downward pressure. Very good work. He's banged himself up again, Lua Manu, but he has been the outstanding harbour player of the first half. They try and muscle their way over Jared Payne. And if that's Jersey 7 that's at the bottom of it. Actually, Boric, but it may well be a card. Anthony Boric. Just put a little bit of psychological pressure on Harbour. It's through the middle, it's an eight point lead. So, more than a converted try is required. I suspect they're going to give another one. So, now goal. Ben Bonacar in great position. Can he win the game? With the left foot drop goal, pushes it away to the left hand side. Can he get the drop kick away? Here we go. Ben Bonacar in very good position. He makes the play. Ben Bonacar makes the play. After a thousand phases, there is devastation for the home team, Northland. And in the end, it was Harbour with good concentration. 25 points to 24. Doesn't get any closer than that. So here's how the teams stack up after two rounds of the ITM Cup. Who would have thought Counties Monaco would be leading the way? Just three teams making it two wins from two. And in the bottom half, Mana were two, Hawke's Bay, Otago and Tasman yet to celebrate a win. Well, that wraps up the ITM Cup for another week. See you next time for highlights from week three.